Hello, my name is Dr. Nancy Bennett. I'm the director of the Center for Community Health at the University of Rochester, and I'm also the chair of the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices for the Centers for Disease Control. The Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices makes recommendations for the use of vaccines for children, adolescents, and adults in the United States. There are many vaccines that are licensed in the United States. However, the decision to use a vaccine is made by the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices. They make recommendations to the Centers for Disease Control, and in turn, the Centers for Disease Control makes those recommendations to the general public and to physicians in the United States. It is really critical that this process occur. While the decision about whether or not to license a vaccine is made by the FDA, and it's based on whether or not the vaccine works and whether or not it's safe. However, the FDA doesn't necessarily take into account the value of the vaccine to the population as a whole. That's what the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices and the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention do. They make very complicated decisions about whether or not the vaccine will really prevent a significant amount of disease, whether or not it is able to be implemented in the US, and whether or not it is cost effective. So by the time your physician recommends a vaccine for your child, it has gone through a very complicated and extensive decision-making process.